Alert, bombshell emails confirm major Huma crime, Hillary in dire panic. Hillary Clinton is one of the shadiest candidates for presidency, and recent events can confirm one's suspicions. Her emails are still being combed through to see if one can find more evidence of suspicious activity and they did. Judicial Watch released a new email from Huma Aden, showing something that has Hillary squirming right now. If you donated to the Clinton Foundation, you could look forward to getting all kinds of special treatment during Hillary's time in the State Department. The emails obtained from Aiden were redacted at the time. However, Hillary's brother, Tony Rodham, emailed Aiden and informed her that he was going to be a go-between for Richard Park, a Clinton Foundation donor. Doug Ban, an executive for the Clinton Foundation, told Aiden that she should try to show love to Andrew Liveris for being a Clinton donor. The most recent batch includes six emails that were not turned into the State Department. 439 emails have been discovered so far since she turned everything over. It looks like when Clinton testified, she gave everything as far as she knew. She's been lying since day one, and investigators and the public are beginning to be more wary of her. One of the cases occurred on November 14, 2009. This is just a small example, and the implications behind it are terrifying. Clinton donor, Ben Ringel, needed to get an Iranian woman a visa so that she could come to the United States without all the hassle. Of course, the logical answer is to contact someone who owes you a debt. Coincidentally, Ringel donated $10,000 on one occasion, and $25,000 on another occasion to the Clinton Foundation. Rigel sent emails to Aben to see if she could make it happen. She confirmed that she could, and worked with another donor named Michael Kah to help process a visa. This is a dangerous scandal that is getting out of hand. If more people continue to do this, there could be hundreds, if not thousands, of people behind bars. Many believe that the emails have proven that Clinton has gone too far with her organization and the only way to fix this is to see Hillary behind bars. How do you think the Clinton Foundation should be dismantled? Share this story on Facebook and let us know because we want to hear your voice.